everyone. Welcome to the New York Times Hard Sudoku for January 25th, 2024. I'll start with my normal scanning techniques. Uh, those two eights in the top three rows force an eight, one of these. Uh, twos are in the same rows, so twos gonna end up in the same spot. And that's all I get for the top rows. The middle rows, I can place a one. Bottom rows, I can't do much of anything. If I look by columns, left third, I can't do much. The bottom, middle third, there's an eight based on these two. Those ones are going to force a one in one of these two. I think that's all I get. Uh, those fives are going to force a five in one of those, but not here. These twos are going to force a two there. Okay, now, um, this is actually my second attempt at it, and I think I made a mistake somewhere, possibly even with trying to put a 4 in box 8, because I ended up with this cell having to be simultaneously must be one of 3, 5, or 9, and then it couldn't be either 3, 5, or 9 because of the given digits in this column. So, with that in mind, uh, these this 4 rules these cells out. This column rolls these out. That's still, unfortunately, three, three spots for a four there. So, I think the error I made was assuming that four could only be in one of these two. And then it must go there. No, it could have gone here, or here, or here. So... I'm in a tough spot. Uh, let's look at box three, though. I've got four digits left. Two of them must be three and six. Neither three nor six can go in these two. So these two cells are a three-six pair. This cell has three looking at it. That must be six. Therefore, that's a three. These are one and nine. And that rules that cell out from being a one. Okay, I've got 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 9. These three cells here are 4, 7, and 8. This has 4 and 8 looking at it. That must be 7. So these two are down to 4 and 8. And this cell has a 4 looking at it. And that'll finish column 8 relatively straightforwardly. That's no longer an 8 at the top right of box number 8. Okay, this cell is quite restricted. It sees every single odd digit, along with 4 and 8. This one's down to just 2 or 6. And that cell is also quite restricted. It cannot be 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7, or 8. That's down to 4 or 9. This is down to 4 or 9. This is 1 or 9, which makes it, things interesting. Uh, these, Okay, this is 7 or 9, I think, because it can't be 1 or 4. That's not 9, but 1, 4, or 7 is still possible. Okay, well, what that's done is that's forced a 7 and 1 of those two, combined with this 7. We'll force one of these three to be a 7. Not here because of that. Uh, what else can I do? Those two fours are going to force a four in one of these two, but can't go there, so it must go here. Uh, these fours are going to force a four there, but not here. Two of these cells must be two and eight. But I don't have either limited to only two spots. That's moderately annoying. Uh, 
let's see, 3, 6, 8 are going somewhere in those cells. Well, actually, 6 is already there, so 3 and 8 must appear in two of these three cells. This can't be 3, so one of those two must be. This cell can't be 8, which means one of these two must be. And that'll take care of 3 and 8 in column 9. Uh, 7 can't go here or here, so 7's in one of these two. But there's still three spots for a 2. That's annoying. Uh, wait a minute, actually. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Those two sixes are going to force one of these two to be a six. Where did I not see that? Uh, along the same lines, oh, I think I just discovered another hidden pair. Where does four go in column seven? It cannot go in these cells. This by given, these by placement of that four. Four in column seven, therefore, must go in one of these three, but it can't go here. So four is down to one of these two, but I've got four and five sharing the same two spots. That's a hidden four, five pair. Okay, that gives me two, three, four, five, seven, eight. So the remaining cells are one, six, and nine in column seven, and that's a perfect weird looking triple. I can't disambiguate any of these any further. Let's see, uh, none of those are four, five, or six. None of these three are two, or seven. Uh, this happens to see one and eight. That also sees a nine, but that sees one and three. Got nothing useful there. Here I have three, four, five, six, eight placed. I need one, two, seven, and nine. These could be just about anything. That doesn't see one or seven. Okay, so. Unfortunately, because this is a 9, I can't make the determination about this two cells and that one. 1 and 7 must appear... Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, neither of these can be 7. Yeah, 7 must go there. Not much we know, but we don't know anything about 2, do we? Or indeed one, which is very irritating. And I'm no closer to figuring out row one. I wish I had something else to go with. Let's see, none of these can be one. No. Yeah, none of these can be 1 or 7, indeed. This can't be 7, so 7's either here or here in row 7. But that could still be 1, irritatingly enough. Okay. Those are not 1, 7, or 4, 5, 8. That's not three, that's not two. Okay. This can't be six. And none of these can be six. So six must go there. Well, with that six, that forces a six down here.
137. That also sees a two. These all see one, three, four, five, seven. The only odd digit left is a nine, and then all the evens. But that, that yeah, they all see four. That one sees six. That one sees nine. This can't be two. This can't be two. Yeah, this is why I took the quarter marks out of two, because I couldn't determine which of these it must be, and two can be here or indeed any of these spots. Uh, row six is interesting. I have one through five. Okay, one, three, four, nine. I need two, five, six, seven, eight. Obviously, can't be six. Oh, that's not seven or eight either. That's interesting. One. Four, seven, eight. By row. Two by column. Okay, this was not helpful. That's two thirds of a six, seven, nine, but I don't have the last third of it. I got nothing to go on officially in row 8 either, which is annoying. Wait a minute. No, oh, 2 is already here. Darn it. Okay, these are not 2, 4, 8. 6 is the only even digit left. Okay, none all right, none of these are six. That's not one. None of these are three. That's not seven. That's not one. Okay. These are restricted. These cells cannot be two, three, six, seven, eight. Well, these aren't three, six, or seven. That's a little help, though. Yeah, the only thing I haven't filled out is down here yet. C 
see, absolutely none of these are 4 or 5. Or 6, either, even. Those are all given digits. That sees 1 in its column. That sees 3 and 9 in its column. Okay. None of these are 6. This isn't 1 or 4. Or 7 or 8. Okay, the entire grid is now filled out. And only really two could be in any one of these spots. Column seven, I'm in great shape. But by far, that's my best column. Wait a second. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. This can't be 7. This can't be 7. Therefore, 7 must be here, and therefore cannot be here. Jeez. Okay, none of these three are seven. This seven must go here. Wait a minute. Okay, I've got something mismarked here. This can't be 7 by placement. That can't be 7 by given. 7 must go here. So these aren't 7, and more importantly, that means that that's a 1. Now, this isn't 1 either. Therefore, that's a 1. It's the only place left. That determines that pair. 9 is going to make that 5, so none of these are 5. Uh, that's, a, that's a triple, so this 9's rolled out. Get rid of 7's there. Because this is now good. That's forced to be a 4. So that's seven. Indeed, that's forced to be a nine. Row one is complete. That's not nine. That's not nine. That's not five, and that's not five either. Two eight looking here, that's a four. Get rid of the 2 and the 8 from there because that's now done. This 5 rolls that out from being a 5 as well as that. This can't be 4 by a place digit. 1 and 7 both come out of here. This isn't 9. Neither is that. Got one forced in one of those. Oh wait a minute. Okay, this can't be two. This these can't. Yeah, these can't be two. So two must go here, which says those can't be two.
two must go here. I'm trying to figure out where my next move is. One must go here. It must be in one of those spots. Place it south. I'm going to argue that this is a one. Because that's the only cell that satisfies this condition and that one. I'm going to run with it and see where it goes. Um, unfortunately, it goes almost nowhere. It says yes, one of those is a one, but we knew that already. Okay, nine must be in one of these two, but that doesn't tell us something we don't know either. Ah, oops. Three goes here. I am no closer to figuring out. Yeah, the right third of the grid's almost done. If I can get that cell figured out, I'd be in wonderful shape. But I ain't there for some reason. Got nothing useful. Two can't go anywhere but there. That's irritating. Irritating. Unless, oh, this can't be four, and these can't be four, and this can't be four, all by given digits. Four must go to one of these two. Eight is in one of the same spots. What I should have seen was this eight, four, and this four, eight combined to force it down there, and that's a hidden four, eight pair. How did I miss that? These can't be 5, and this can't be 5 because of that, so that tells me that must be a 5. That'll unwind a lot of digits. This 8 comes over here. That's a 2. Uh, this isn't. Neither is that. Not 2, not 2, not 2 or 8. 6, 8 looks here, which that's now forced to be a 9. This has to be a 3. No. Not necessarily. Oh, well, yeah, no. 3, 7. Okay, so 6, 8 looking here. 9, and that's going to force this cell to be a 2. This is not 2. 2 looks up. That's 6. The 
these aren't, but this 6 is going to come over here. That's a 9. So 3, 8. This can't be 3 or 8. That's a 1, which forces that to be a 6. This is a 1. These are 7, 9, I think. Nine, seven, nine. That's a triple that's left. That six comes down here. This is an eight. Column two is done. Row nine is done. This eight comes over here. That's seven. These aren't. That's a five eight pair, which makes that two. Eight two. Eight comes down here. That's five. So that's three. That's seven. That's three, that's eight, that's five. The left third of the grid is completely finished. These are six and nine now. In fact, none of these four remaining cells are a six. That's also not nine. Three comes down here, which I just now saw. That's a five. This isn't. Whoops. It's five I want to delete. Five forces that to be a two. This isn't two. These are three, seven. These are six, nine. That three is going to make this nine. Seven, nine. These are not nine. That's, that's down to two or six. This has a two looking at it. Okay, well, this has a 9 looking up. That's 6. 9. Not 9. Uh, this 6 makes that 9. That must be 7. That's 6. Uh, that's 7, and that's 3. Okay, well, once I figured out how to unwind all my logic, that was not bad. <sighs> but... I got done, and that's what counts. Yay.